Hey guys, Dan the Wolfman here, and out in the wild, I see a new pistol, IWI uh, Masada Slim, 13 plus one uh, with this mag. I think there might be a 15 round mag or two 13s, I forget which. Anyway, interesting, slim, micro compact. I think it's longer, like a 3.42, 3.44 barrel. Optics ready. Uh, feels good in the hand. I could use a little bit more texturing, but it's not bad. Uh, empty firearm, that's why the slide was open. You got a blacked out rear, even though there's places for dots. So thank you for not doing stupid three white dots. Uh, it is you battle st uh, sight style. So decent sights, feels good in the hand. I don't muzzle you. Uh, hold on one second, guys. I'm gonna show you the reset. Trigger take up, so a trigger dingus. I mean, not bad for a micro compact. Boom, we're at a wall. Short, but watch how short this uh, reset is. I gotta reset the slide. Sorry, bad video, but I'm amazed at how short this reset is. That was it. <laughs> super, super short, tactile, audible. Uh, so the reset's nice. Now let me show you the bad thing about this pistol. Unfortunately, I think the sales are gonna be bad because you have to lock the slide back with the mag out, shove this tab forward, and then it has a little wolf in it like a Ruger Max 9 uh, does so people are not gonna like that I can live with it though I'm always scared I lose the little roll pin especially if you're uh, done shooting and you want to clean before you go home like I often do and anyway a uh, great pistol other than unfortunately a design flaw that they probably could have avoided it feels good in the hand with the magazine in. I can actually get a full grip I have extra large hands not super large but but uh, fairly big and uh, for appendix carry this is definitely a good option if you're really careful with that light short striker take up anyway guys kaboom let me know what you think of it